once again, I am Vipa Lakitsing and you're chilling with me. It is time for TDM Wiley. How, how are you? Hi, boy. This week is awesome. It's girl power. We are the only ones here apart yeah. from me. Who run the world? <laughs> <Lepapo>. Girls, <laughs> do who run the world? Lavapo is gone. <laughs> and we're having time to ourselves, eh? Yes. How are you? But we still have our visitor with us. So uh -huh. Rempofu. Rempofu. Uh, Rempofu. Uh, Rempofu. 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 No, How are you? Yeah, we are good, we are good, we are uh, good. Let us read our listeners now, go ahead and send it to me. Okay, um, Dimelan Baretti, hello young people, greetings to all of you who are listening from wherever. Dimelan Banaba Kachika, I love you, I know you are listening in Francistown. Masunga, I know you are listening in Kalape, everywhere. So, I am going to go to the house. 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 I what do they think about ethics? Have you came up across a conflict of ethics or what are your experiences in workplaces? What are your workplaces to do with young workplace? Or maybe, let us say, can you please give us a word about ethics? What are we talking about with ethics? What are we talking about? Ethics. Mm -hmm. Before we go, ethics. scenario. Only then they will be able from this scenario to mm -hmm. reduce what we are talking about. In according to the following situations, if you were to encounter the following situation, for example, you are a tenderpreneur and you find yourself caught up between doing what is good and paying a bribe you know that when you pay a bribe you'll be acting illegally and unethically but why is it how will you do what will you do this scenario they're already calling. <laughs> Duma FM, hello. Hello. Duma. Go together we can. <laughs> because <laughs> we're on ethics, we're talking about ethics and we're giving you case scenarios. If you are to encounter them, uh, what do you do in a position that M. Wiley has already read out? Can you give us uh, the second case in a, Oh, there's a caller here. Mm -hmm. Duma FM, hello. Duma. Let's say uh le teselezo license ya go phetsa hela no thokana le license ya PSV o ntse o le ka go pala o le ka go pala go transport e mo go transport ba go rara me ga o ka nela 5000 teng yana hela PSV ya ga go eta tsa ke ta go inela la itiaka what will you do you know that if you pay that 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 bribe ya go bona PSV it's illegal and it's unethical but rape we itse gore ga o sa ga o sa what will you do we do my fm hello 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 has to together we can, but we're more in sync. We are talking ethics. We are talking ethics. ethics. Call us on at three five zero zero one three one three five zero zero one three one. Duma FM, hello. Duma. Erra Dumela. 
Thank you. transport.
Jamila. Hello. Okay. Duma, hello. Duma. I don't know what I'm Okay. Me, Rita, only a few have called in to explain the issues with the corruption of the DDY gang. As I'm going to ask you, I'm going to ask you about the ethics. This is not the general narrative. The general narrative is going to be able to talk about it. So, I'm going to ask you about the ethics. It's essential for us to explore the concept of ethics to assess what a retamahaka is on the level of ethical awareness really banana really as long as 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 well as our personal ethics we do have personal ethics we have principles and values that as individuals we live by we value them and then uh, similarly we also have uh, organizational ethics the components are very common that's why and therefore they those exist in order to provide uh, bullying and guidelines and also to prevent issues is that job dissatisfaction really stress also to reduce the issues to provide guidance how on the ethical dilemmas usually where there are no um, compliance to to ethics whether organizational or personal we tell her when not to get back on the money like they learn over the Helena the values thank you for nothing the little lap a hell in a little values for example more one I hold on a is over the mother being I'm going to tell you that I'm pretty mellow when they buy six or look I don't know what's happening I was starting my mother but they expect me to be to be home those are part of the values so let's say hold on with you what's a new role I got on it especially personal values are grounded and anchored on uh, uh, cultural societal values and then organizational ethics how deliver when we talk about this ethics hella ethics uh the golden rules from those biblical ten commandments thou shall not kill thou shall not steal thou shall not commit adultery thou shall not lie and thou shalt not covet, etc., etc. That's my thing here. I don't know what I'm saying. What can you call the ethics? It's a total, total. This is a guy. Me rempo. We talk about the total law thing. For the total, me want the ethics. This is a guy. This two side. And regarding Carlos and Regine, both cases are like a so far. We we are using both languages here, and we know that organizations that don't have ethics. The hell are these in a bully? Who affect the reputation? Yeah, boy. Who affect the credibility? Yeah, boy. Who affect the vibrate? Keep a boy. Kahore, kahore. Kahadina me lawan. Yone e laolang kore. Ah, e gai de lebut sa maisi bui te kore bui kaya file kaya. Because ethics they provide what we call moral norms or moral norms and laws or moral guidance or it's like a moral compass. They create a moral climate. They relay. So for example, how do you say people get to know a company? That's only the ethics of the company. Like I'm going to own that. Now, why it's relevant? Now, how can I? Corruption is illegal law. It's it's corruption is allowed. Bribery is allowed. What not is allowed in certain organizations. For example, without ethics, reputation is how only business owner, business is how we hell like it's here. Can we pay? Lidi tiro dimu, mero mugo kwa na kwa afekta tiri sanyo mugo ya haro, kwa na kwa afekta lidi investara, kwa na kwa afekta imeji ya kumusi chari. Rempo fu u u take it up from here and try and adi chashele leto taka kore. Ribu ya leba na na bailo kore they want to venture into businesses. Kore ba ito kore idio te ribu toka kore kare kore ba tama isa di organization sabo ni do kobo tabo ni ja. Let us take a little break, then from then we'll be having a elaborate on what you the book. Sidi, let us get back to our discussion. Yeah, ramp of water ethics. Ramp of Right. Um, maybe let's start this way. Yeah. 
Yeah. If, let's build on what we discussed last week. Yeah. Or what is entrepreneurship? Mm -hmm. Who is an entrepreneur? Mm -hmm. And if you recall, one of the things we said about an entrepreneur at the you must be a trustworthy person. Mm -hmm. Uh, you must have passion, mm -hmm. uh, you must be reliable, mm -hmm. Now, those qualities, they speak to what we call personal ethics mm -hmm. Okay? Now, what is that to end these ethics? You see, when a person hung on our shoulder, a psychology clean, ครับครับแท้ก็ทะลุลาสกัสพอสติคลีนครับครับแท้ที่ใครจะสิบกับครับเช่นนี้ใครจะสิบกับนรกหานุจูตะหันนัยยาเมื่อหันซาฟอลล
So ethics are meant to make sure Corin, those things are kept to a minimum. Mm -hmm. Yes. So that then we have common values. Mm -hmm. They don't we are common each other. Mm -hmm. Because we have a common goal. If it's to make money or to uh, make profit, mm -hmm. then that is the, the driving uh, motivation for Nava Road. So it's not an issue of our business economy and therefore Kiraya mm -hmm. Kirata and Luna you must follow mm -hmm. That's again the importance of what? Personal ethics, how it links with organizational ethics. Jamu uh, what are the advantages in Mehela? We had to when you got we were touching on them here and there slightly. So Missouri City is on organizational ethics. Who benefit a young company, the corporation, where we are, it benefit a young company, organizational ethics. What are the advantages of that? Well, to the main advantage, because we are we are talking small businesses. Mm -hmm. Of course, if we are talking big businesses, I think the the, the approach would be slightly different. Yeah. But because we are talking small businesses, and maybe most of us uh, young people and mm -hmm. so on, mm -hmm. advantage is that if you have ethics, more business in your house, people tend to trust. Uh -huh. Or a, they can do business with you. Trust. Trust. Mm -hmm. Okay? And then they also see you as a serious money person. Mm -hmm. You are organized. Mm -hmm. You know what to want. Mm -hmm. I get how to go on. Who business is. I grow up. So, what are you going to do with the discerning customers and investors? You can have that. But, like, you are giving you your house. Exactly. Oh, you are going to go on. You are going to go on. Now you are the brand, the uh -huh. company, how? So you attract people to your company. Your mm -hmm. character will attract people to your company. How you present yourself, mm -hmm. how you are meeting me, how are you going to meet uh, uh, a potential, potential investor? Potential investors. Right? How are you going to Those are they speak to your character, mm -hmm. like Robert. Mm -hmm. That's personal character, but it becomes the brand. Uh -huh. You see, because but to value our own character, we have a perception of our own image. We have a good image. But when we look into it, can we really trust the form of our own character? We can say things. The motive of our money, you know, I know our. You see, so you don't take yourself for granted or assume or because we are not on there, then people will soon sort of accept on there. Once you have that kind of an attitude, then you have a problem. Because it's not about yourself, it's also about other people, how you impact other people and how they perceive you. Mm -hmm. Right. Interestingly, it goes back to another case scenario, which was there. Mm -hmm. The case scenario, which was mentioning relationships in a working place, like, uh, uh, is it ethical for you to get involved in a relationship um, in the same mm -hmm. compound mm -hmm. or with your subordinate? Can I know? Oh, my God, I'm going to go. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the scenario was uh, at your workplace. Is it ethical? Mm -hmm. Is it right? Uh, in a workplace, to have intimate relationships. Yeah. For example, can a director, is it okay and ethical for a director, a CEO, a supervisor or accountant at the workplace to date an employee or a junior? Is it right? Is it ethical? If it's not right, why would you say it's not right? What would be the problem with that? If you say, ah, the director or the secretary Hello, Junior. Uh, what will be the possible challenges of situations? Scenarios as in Zinia. Relating, Ruton Gorelari. Campo, if you bring down to the level, how long will it work for me? Campo, a taxi, and pick up an every day. A while ago, like about Zadiba and Ava every day. 
Is it okay for you to start having those kind of relationships? How do you feel? Uh, is it ethical for you to date? Uh, those intimate relationships with your workmates? Oh, do my hello. Hello. Do my. Hello. Hello. Ah, <laughs> 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 Uh, when it becomes like this, it brings forth the case of appreciating conflict mm -hmm. values. That's where personal values and organization. Now, how do we create a balance? Because there is prone to be a conflict. Mm -hmm. If uh, like re, um, if your personal values this are line let's a compound. This is not that I'm going to This is affect the investors. This is affect the bottom. When I look at how I have to fund, bottom is my job. 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 Bottom being ethical is doing what's right, being able to establish and distinguish between right and wrong, whether or not people are watching you. Like, how, 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 
go tsana le mone moretsi wa moliti wa ntha go bua moya wa PSV mo le gore ene go robala boroko kho mo ene gore khona gore ka di perfume tse di tswa mo di strateng mo tsa di bento o kana sengwe hela o bana motho ngwana hela ta mo lapeng ka television e kana kana ya plasma no a itse ngwana ga go ga be re ke en le tsalo la go ga le gore le re o re ngwana o morewe ka ntho go mo go tswa ka e go tsere ka a go ra re go gore kile no utse gore ga theogele go o re kile ka e jang a o gore kile ka bento a do we have ethics tsei lo gore ke ona me lawana e ikagile mo boteng ba rona e laolang ka re dirisanya ka teng le ba khwedi ba bangwe le ba re bere ka le bona re mpo o ya ra ba ya yona kha yone ya gore tsone midinyala na ya mmuno o setse o di tha o di tlhalusitse o rile ngwana o tsholo a se na selavi a le thabula ra sa le pure and innocent is the society the environment that we grow in where we learn all these things like for example go thapatsa o go rogana go thoka go itse go nna le go bo re ditsa mo distracting some of the things we learn from our peers as young people de be di hella inna and norm can't tell they form part of the values tsa rona mo ene gore ha ke re ke gele ba ba mo maikuto le ha ke bua ke bua anyhow therefore who to permeate mo tirong ya me mo business ya no ga go tlhagella go ntse go ithupa le mo tirong e ke itira mo business me being an ethical o le mo gwe di di phethotsa teng ye nna ye nne he if if is you are a highly an ethical organization e associate wa le bone bo corruption e go na le discrepancy se tse le go re se re se bua ga se se re se dira we we talk about me ha la ke tsana mo di ka go ntle go pa thuso botho ga ke bo bone ga ke bo a mogele ke re se faeng i receive negative attitude from the employees ba ke tlhe ntlo go tlhaka thuso go tsone i receive a uh, uh, aggression go re o ka re motho ntuso ya ka as a la tlhalla sa ba te go ntuso me ha le ha ke tsana mo corridor mo yana at the reception the values are a placard there tse di simolana hela ka botho so san tha ke ha se ka here yes ke hala ka ne re bua go um you know that the, the starting point to her how are you more if i'm poor for the name of business who are you for someone like our your mm -hmm. character mm -hmm. because you know it's there you are going to find them in the space yeah and how proper are you doing wow but you can never tell anything now the difficult part is always the personal ethics ya ho re tse tsone ga di a kwalwa ha di le ga ntse ga di kwa e ke kwa it's unlike business ethics ya re tse re khona di kwa la for what for it this is how we we are going to to operate ya no tse di personal because ga di a kwa they speak to our own conscience e ho re wana le tsoro la go le go ra le a la re this is right or that is wrong you see so the choice is yours Now if you are not concerned about the brand making yourself a brand mm -hmm. business or a brand mm -hmm. then it means anything goes mm -hmm. like raw one so you might find then in the process for the kind of customers who are attracted ke ba leng gore go ngwe le bona ba o pharitse ala ka wena me is that what you want mm -hmm. like raw one you see mm -hmm. good is like evil attracts evil you know? exactly. good attracts good yes. if i'm uh, if i'm corrupt I'm I'm bound to attract people who 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 are of similar mind like myself who will be coming with money because they can perceive what I have a corrupted mind and attributes and corrupted um uh, approach to business ka gore ke ka gore motho a ka khona go ta go 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 yena rempo ka beke ya madi ka le hitshwana a ba ta gore wa prove go nwe for example tender ya ka me aka se ke ate ko go bui o phikile seng ka ga wena go re wena you are open to this kind of behavior ga gona di ethics ga gona le tswana ba itirelwa exactly ya no me re le bana na re ba tla go foma di khwapo me re ba tla di khwapo tse le gore di na le boleng go ntse ya lo ga le gore di compound tsa rona di to itse ge ka me kwa yone e le gore e ta be ha tla ba khwele go to go nna bokete go Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who are you? 
the attributes it's up. Okay, what are your strengths? What are your weaknesses? Mm. Like Rawa, mm. how soon a week is there mm. Then you move to the next step. Business is about to be a big deal. It's a big sector. Because that is what now is going to ask you for a lot of schooling mm. to get some training mm. in relation to to this thing. Mm. Before you actually start the business, <coughs> like yeah. Rawa. And then once you have those basic skills and knowledge about the business that you want to go mm. into, then you are ready to go into business. Okay. See? Because now you know yourself, you know your your, your strengths, you know your weaknesses, mm. and then because those like in the last week, career is schooling. Yeah. Schooling is more being yeah. in the environment for the Yeah. But the second phase, A L and go schooling to one about communication skills, mm. uh, how to keep records, so in those mm. those things you get them mm. from a formal setup. Yeah. Yeah. That is the second phase. Yeah, one number of it. Once you have those two, then you are ready now to start the business. Mm -hmm. like because you know what a combination of those two, mm. it's able to solve whatever challenges you meet, mm. you are able to navigate. Awesome. A quick a minute of advice to the listeners to Mwabi Omwatana regarding ethics. I believe that banana variety. Hello, hello. Go well, sir. And I couldn't say more. And they have learned a lot, a lot. Until we meet again on Saturday, it has been nice. It has been fun. Awesome. Thank you. See you next week. Bye. Okay. Thank you.